Welcome to this video where I will be showing you how to create an assembly of your components you've created in Fusion 360. So the first thing you'll need to do is to create a new drawing, so a new design, and in here we're going to take the components we've designed in our other files and put them into here. As I've said in previous videos, it's far easier for me working this way than it is trying to work all inside one document that way I can create them and then go back in and out change different versions like I'm not going to accidentally do anything to one of the components whilst I'm editing another so once we've opened up this file before we can import one of these into here we need to save it so file save make sure you're choosing the correct place you want to save it Once that's finished saving, we can then find our first component, the one you want to be pretty much in the middle, and then right click, insert into current design. It'll take a moment to go in. Then it'll ask you if you want to move it around. If you're happy with its position because it's the first component, you can just say OK. And then we'll find our second component. And let's do this one. Now with this component, what we want to do is move it out of the way so that we, then we can use the Align tool to put it exactly where we want. So just pick it up, drag it, and say OK. Now we want to align this part here with that face there. So we need to go to Modify, Align, and this will allow you to choose a point on your component to then align to a point on the other component. So what I want to do is to align the center of this hole with the center of that hole there. So you can see at the moment it's aligned but it's in the wrong orientation. So all I need to do now is keep clicking on these until I get it to where I want. Try that. There we go. That's the alignment I want for this particular component where it's sitting vertically. We say OK, go to our next component, same again, drag it out, modify, align. Now here, this is where I probably want to put that in my toolbar, so if I remove this one, and then remove that one. Wow, all the way apart from the one I want. I'll just do this then, it's quicker. So, but you can do that if you want to. Align this part to there. I don't want this hole facing horizontally, I want it vertically, so just change it around and done. And the last part is the pin. A lot smaller, move it this way just because it's over that side anyway, make placing it a lot easier. Now, this is where we're going to need to zoom in. Because we want to get that part just there aligned. Need to change the Angle. And if we zoom out a bit, that'll help. That's the one. And then zoom out. We want to align it to there. That's the one. And just double check we've got it exactly where we want. And we do. And there we have our assembled piece. From here, we can take that in and do an assembly drawing, which we'll show you in the next video.